Oxford, Mississippi, one of the great scenes for a college football game in the country. The activity begins at Suns this year. 5'7", 147 pounds. And it will be returned a yard in. Out to the 20-yard line. So it uh, out of bounds. There's the handoff. This is McCluster coming left. Watch out. Foot race. Danny McCray has an angle on him and knocks him out of bounds. Sneed shakes the tackle. Under some pressure from Levingston. Gets around the corner. Fumbles it out of bounds. Shepard with the hit. Wow. That one cuts inside the right upright, and Ole Miss split wide to the right. It's an empty backfield on second and 14. Ole Miss showing a blitz. They are not blitzing. Good protection for Jefferson. Too high, intercepted. Picked off on the far side. This is Cassius Vaughn. All the way in. Touchdown, Ole Miss. There is a flag. It's at the nine-yard line. Called the interception. The after the interception. Illegal block in the back. 85 under defense. Unsportsmanlike conduct. Diving into the end zone by the receiving team. Both players will be in four. What? Well, they'll get it. That's that'll go okay. Be. The block. No. Here's McCluster, caught by Raheem Alem, slowed up just enough so that he is tackled in the back. It goes down. The official on the field says he went out of bounds. And the official who made the call is Rob Skelton, the field judge. He was also the man who signaled touchdown. Here's Sheen, blocked. It's blocked and heading toward LSU's direction. Picked up, and the foot race is on. It's Patrick Peterson. Touchdown, LSU. How about that, Vern? El Miss thinks they scored twice. Right. LSU scores once. LSU scores. The only running back. Lionel Bro starts in motion. Sneed rolling right. Pulls up. High. Oh, wide open. How about that? Down the sidelines. Mark Keith Summers, number 16. It's the quarters. They say the tough part is it's 11 on 11. With a quarterback, it's 10 on 11. Yeah. Now McCluster split wide right here. Sneed back. Goes into the flat right side. McCluster. And he's tackled as he gets to the eight yard line by Kelvin. Six yards out. Up and good. So despite before this game began, second down and 10. Keelan Williams, large gap right side. And a first down. LaFell among those in the backfield. Here's Jefferson back. Good protection. He finds LaFell, another LSU first down. This one at the 13-yard line. Well, this is an option. 7-6. Jefferson in the end zone, caught, touchdown. Ruben Randall, the freshman, a 17-yard touchdown. Well, Cassius Vaughn got LSU in Jordan Jefferson, and Jordan Jefferson, staring down a pass rush, got Cassius Vaughn. Double move to the outside, and he got him. And I'll tell you, this was a great play by Jefferson because he took one right as he let the ball go. Really high expectations for Randall at the beginning of the season, but that is only his eighth catch of the year and his first touchdown. Yard line. No. 
Marquis Summers starts in motion. Play fake. Sneed into the flat. It's caught by Bolden, and he's got another first down, it would appear, at the 39-yard line. Right side. Oh, boy, almost picked off. Instead, Marquis Summers has the ball and a first down. Driving on LSU. McCluster with Hartman leading the way. Gets around the corner. Gets by Riley. A little come to the other side. That was an unbalanced look. Now it becomes third and seven. Three wide receivers right side, one to the left. Little flip out, one-on-one, -on -one. McCluster, he's in trouble. Harry Cole from 34 yards away. And it is good. Now he's in motion. Jefferson back, looks deep, fires it. He's got a man. It is caught by Tolliver. Ten now. Jefferson takes off left side way short. Lower ankle sprain, not 100%. Here is Josh Jasper from 50. Got it! Boy, he got height on that Grandy, one of two men deep. Onside kick. Who got it? It looked like LSU's Peterson might have got it. Uh-oh. This is going to be close. Thank you. Ruled out of bounds. Ruled out of bounds. There's the kick. There's Peterson. Free kick out of bounds. Well, I think that time he was out calling yep. the field was right. What is it about Patrick Peterson oh and was he in or was he out? I yes. think that's the great call right yep. there. Yeah. His left foot was dragging on the play, but I actually don't think he caught the ball till his right foot came down and controlled it. He was dragging his left foot exactly the way you teach a wide receiver. For the kick going out of bounds, be tacked on from the out of bounds spot. First down. How about the Mad Hatter? Bama. Uh, he insists that he did. It looked like he did. Here's the pass complete left side. Football. Yep. LSU's got it. Russell, Kelvin Shepard. And Chad Jones pulled it free. He sure did. Chad Jones, the hero of that Mississippi State game. Well, here we are. After review, video shows the receiver caught the ball. His knee was on the ground before the ball came. The ball was moving just an inch, but I thought he still had possession too. I could argue either way on that one. You're amphibious, in other words. Absolutely. Yeah, okay. Across the middle, Shea Hodge breaks the tackle down inside the 10. Here, playing from behind, very accurate, seven of his last seven. Third and goal from the three. Right side, touchdown, Grandy. Jesse Grandy, the freshman who has specialized as a kickoff returner, gets the touchdown. Hurry out of the huddle, quick snap, got it. Sneed rolls right, pulls up, goes in the end zone, knocked away incomplete. Jefferson rolling right. Oh, to Oliver. A first down and a six. Blitz. Jefferson got him. Not now. No. <laughs> you know. May take a few years. <laughs> Third and six. Oh, dear. Across the middle and incomplete intent. Not a final yet. We were just told. Guy in college football. And Stephanie with a valiant 12-year fight against cancer, which she lost 
late this week. Left side catch is made at the 33 yard line. You lock the out on and you just throw it against bump coverage. Here's Grandy in motion again. They give it to McCluster again. That's about the fourth time. But he but again as we talked about early he's got a healthy McCluster right. Now. Gonna pass. He is, and he's got a man wide open. It's Hodge. Touchdown, Ole Miss. Who said he couldn't pass? Well, better from this formation. He missed all five he tried a year ago. He completes this one for 27 yards and a go-ahead score. Credit, but he's got a horse there now. Sheen. They feel they're a quality football team. Keelan Williams, Trahan got him. That's a fumble. Who's got it? It's recovered by LSU. Well, Jonathan. And that makes it third and ten officially. Blitz coming, Sneed lets it go, has a man open, it's Shea Hodge. Wow, what a weapon he's been today. Sneed, wide open is Hodge. Hodge to the 20, it's another first down for 29. Right side, Bolden, no, fourth down, they'll have to try the field goal. And I wonder if LSU... ...turned 53 yards by Patrick Peterson. For an LSU touchdown. He's three of four. Got it. Spread. Ole Miss with four down. Here's the option play. Left side, Ridley gets a block and a lot more. Out of bounds at the 36, forced there by Jonathan. Back-to-back -back plays, they play coverage. Blitz from the corner. Oh, he's got it to the 25-yard line. That might be. Jefferson deep in the right corner. Man is open. It's caught. Touchdown. Ruben Randall, number two, his second grab for a TD in the ball game. And what did they? Again for the tie. They are coming. Ole Miss is bringing them all. That's LaFell in motion. Jefferson with pressure. Incomplete. College rules, you have to have four players to the other side of the kicker. Oh, he got it! LSU has it! Brandon LaFell in perfect stride. That ball never bounced up high. LaFell took it. Here comes the blitz again. Jefferson lets it go. LaFell out of a tackle. Still surging to the 30-yard line. The wide Three down for Ole Miss. They threaten the blitz. They're bringing five. Jefferson rolling right. Being chased. Got him at the 41. Emmanuel Stevens, number 95. Saran blitz. They might be coming again, Ole Miss. No, they're not. Little quick screen out to the left. Ridley in trouble. Fourth down. Fourth down and 26. Ole Miss has five up front, six back. Jefferson is nailed as he lets it go. It's caught! Tolliver! 
with one second left. Get your field goal team on. You have to get your field goal team on. And here, what are they doing? You don't have time to ground the what ball. What are you they doing? Play. Game over. Why do you not have your field goal team Should out there? Should have run his field goal team out there. My I think, gosh! I think they waited too long on third down to call a timeout also.